What is going on, everybody? Welcome to Sports Talk with Broads. And what we have here for you today is an episode with the Atlanta Braves and the Philadelphia Phillies. And what happened last time we played, it was the home opener series. Gabe Kapler decided to make horrible moves. And I wanted the, I wanted this one. This one's huge. And we fall 2-1. to one. And what sucks is this was going for 7 straight. I really, really wanted it. But before we begin, hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe. Comment if you'd like to because I enjoy speaking with you guys. And I just had to record an episode about the Sixers and their loss to the Miami Heat. And here I am discussing a uh, Philly's loss. And it just sucks. It's two losses in a row for Philadelphia sports tonight. Aaron Nola, six innings, four hits, two earned runs, one walk, two strikeouts, 85 pitches. Was it too early? Do you think Gabe Kapler decided to pull him too early? On top of that, we have Scott Kingery playing second. Cesar Hernandez, he hits the bench for today. And Scott Kingery actually ends up leading off and goes 0 for 4 with one walk. On top of that, Odubel Herrera goes 2 for 4, and he was the only run producer for the Phillies today. He had a home run in the top of the first inning. And that's it. That's the only run that we produced. I mean, it was one of those games where it was kind of boring, let's be real, because in the bottom of the first, Freeman actually responds with a ground out into a double play, but that actually ends up scoring a run. And then in the bottom of the fourth, Suzuki hits a fly to right, which scores another runner. So after the fourth inning, it was kind of just a a boring game, not much going on. Aaron Nola decides, let's get a loss, and that's what he does. The Sixers, wow, I read my shirt in the stream. The Phillies get a total of six hits on this one and looking at some of those jp crawford let's go he gets two hits today he reaches on an infield single and he also gets a single to left center so that's two hits for jp and he actually moved up into the lineup today i saw that he was batting sixth sixth in the lineup today good for him aaron altair coming coming off of his monster home run the other night he goes 0 for 3 and walked once Franco 0 for 4 and did not get on base at all Alfaro 0 for 3 um Nick Williams 1 for 1 that's what I'm saying him and Aaron Altair seem to be battling for a spot and uh, Nick Williams to me is just giving him a little bit more in my opinion that's just my opinion right now Nick Williams seems to be giving me a little bit more than Aaron Altair considering Altair is batting a 077 batting average <laughs> and Nick Williams is 294 so you know, not much to take away from this one. The Bats, they gave us six hits, but only produced one run, and that was in the top of the first inning. Aaron Nola, he goes six innings, and he was pulled with 85 pitches. Um, You know, yeah, that's just where I'm at with it. Just, eh. It's not like our bullpen allowed anything else up, so I guess I really can't hate on it because... It's not like he pulled Aaron Nola again, and this is when the Braves were like, oh, let's get on this miraculous run. It wasn't anything like that. Aaron Nola did his thing and allowed both runs, so, you know, he gets the loss, and and we'll move on from this. I I do want to win this series, though. This series means a lot to me. This is a true test, like I said in the previous ones, on where we're going to be at, because now we fall to 9-6, and and the Braves are 9-6, and so we're tied with the Braves in this in this division where the Mets are kind of taking over right now. So, a little bit of a shorter episode, but what, what can I say? It's 2-1, to one, a loss for the Phillies, 9-6, and six, and then we come back and play this team again. So, let's see what we have in tank. Let's see what we have for in, in store for the rest of this series. I just want to win this series. You're not going to win them all. You're right. We go for a seven-game win streak, and we fail. We won six in a row. We lose the seventh. Okay, let's move on to the next one, and I can't wait to see Atlanta again tomorrow. That's what it's all about. It's all about seeing them again tomorrow. So, with that being said, hit the thumbs up button, subscribe, comment if you'd like to. I would love to speak with you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you next time.